Watch Dr. Drew's new show at 9 on HLN. Weeknights on HLN. How will the release of this 911 tape affect the rest of the family? A death by suicide, obviously, very impactful. Well, you know, it's... It is. It's very impactful, and I think it's going to be very difficult for the family to have this out there. Um, but I have to say, on another angle, is we don't talk about suicide enough in this country. You know, suicide is much more common than homicide. 30,000 people die by suicide every year. Seven, 750,000 make an attempt. It's the third cause of death in teenagers and college students. And so, although it's going to be very difficult for the family, None of us are immune from this. And one of the things that's the most frustrating is everyone said that Russell wasn't depressed before this happened. And if you hear what we heard on those tapes, he wasn't responding to friends and family for three days. That's a key symptom of depression, withdrawal. And we know that he, or I just read, he was on antidepressants for anger, another key symptom of depression. And he had gone off his antidepressants, is what I read, weeks before the suicide. So we really need to educate people on how to recognize these signs, because if his friends and family had known, perhaps they could have done something to help him. Uh, Lisa, you're shaking your well, head there. What? I mean, come on. You're losing your business. You're losing your marriage. You're on a reality TV show where you're the bully bad guy. Of course he's going to be depressed. He, would, he wouldn't be a human being. You'd be a robot not to be depressed. So to hear people say he wasn't depressed, that's absolute absurdity. Of course yeah. he's depressed. Right. And, and, you know, and you know very well Imagine everything that... that you care about and imagine not having an opportunity to show another side of you. You know, the, the funny thing about reality TV, you have to remember, it's, it, there, it's real, but it's also edited. And you could take all the good, and you could take all the bad, and you can make a character any way you want. So I, I, to hear a psychologist or a psychiatrist or anyone say he wasn't depressed, he was seriously depressed. I, let, me, let me clarify. About... Let me clarify. Let me clarify. Go ahead, I'm Lisa. not saying that he wasn't depressed. I'm saying that I'm frustrated by all of the people who have publicly, that have been close to Russell. I'm, I have been saying this whole time he's been depressed, even on this show, when people are blaming just the reality show. And what I'm saying is he was depressed. But a lot of people close to him have said he showed no signs of depression. And that's absolutely not true. He clearly did show signs of depression. That's what I was saying. That, that's a very good yeah. point, Lisa Boeski and Lisa Gessner. I'd like to, to have you follow up on that question because of your experience in reality television. How real is, quote, reality television? It is real. It is real. But you, you know, you go in with the best of intentions and everybody goes in thinking that this could be the best thing ever for them.